Okay, Machine Girl. Yeah. Th this is kind of in the vein of kind of like a Tokyo Gore Police, kind of just not as extreme. You have a young woman whose brother is kind of accidentally murdered. Kind of. Somewhat. By the, the, the local Yakuza. And decides to get a revenge. Of course she inadvertently gets her arm cut off. But luckily she's helped by people who fashion her a giant machine gun arm. Yes, which she then uses to just blow the daylights out of people. Any moments where, well, she'll shoot a hole through somebody or shoot somebody's face entirely off. This movie was just so over the top. With, like, the really cheesy, very over the top practical gore effects. Great film. Just super cheesy, super over the top. It's great to know that there's, like, there's this huge moment of, like, Japanese films that this is what they do. It's like, we're gonna pick a girl. Uh, schoolgirl outfit. Uh, mm, loses an arm. Uh, machine gun. Totally rocks machine gun arm. Uh, and towards the end, she needs to fight kind of mutant hybrid guys that we're gonna have in, like, football uniforms. This is gonna work. It's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be awesome. What do you call it? Machine Gun Girl? No, that sounds stupid. Machine Girl. 